Hallo Opa. Hallo Charlie. Schön, dass du da bist. Hi Karen, how are you? I'm okay, I'm still quarantined at home for one more week. Oh, well, I hope to see you back in the office very soon. Bye. Bye bye. We talk of telepresence when the focus is more on helping communication between two people, which is a bit of the simpler case. But often we also want teleoperation, in which case not only are you talking to people through Pepper, but you can also be driving Pepper around. So when people talk about telepresence or teleoperation, there are actually a lot of quite different use cases. For example, Pepper in a reception area that can talk to people and put you in contact with employees. Pepper in a hospital that allows to visit sick family members. We have built something more like a telepresence toolkit with a lot of components that you can combine together to build something corresponding to your use case. Pepper will automatically detect obstacles and not get too close to them and uh, will never hit into them. Another important aspect is uh, security. You have on one side a web page through which an operator can control Pepper and on the other side, maybe a different city, you have Pepper. And we need to ensure that anybody unauthorized will not be taking control of Pepper or even just listening on on the conversation. I wanted to ask you more about the Dubai shipment. Let me check with the word harvest. All right. We provided this project open source on GitHub, providing two very simple samples. One being pure telepresence, so only communication, video and audio both ways. And another one being pretty much pure teleoperation. So in this case, we're just driving a Pepper around. Pepper is a great solution for engaging in immersive telepresence. I hope that Pepper can help a lot of people connect with each other.